30. That's AM, not PM. Not not postmortial meridian. What the fuck does the M stand for in PM? 6.30 AM. I'm about to start filming a couple videos. Hey, sir. Saturday morning, but I'm going into Manhattan at 10.30. We're going to brunch at 12.30, and I'll be out there for the rest of the day, assuming that I'll be pretty hungover tomorrow. But I made a commitment, a promise, I'm gonna have a video out every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I know if I don't film it today and get it ready and posted for Monday before I leave for the city today, I'm not gonna wanna do it tomorrow. So, got a plan, got a prep. I have my content schedule. Basically I wrote a schedule of like everything I need to do day by day and it's a lot of stuff in order to keep track and in order to make sure I maintain my current like pace and make sure I get every piece out there on time. I don't know, that's where I'm at. Just in the nick of time, baby. The nick of time, wow. I'm gonna dominate today. Just finished editing the video. Steve's coming to get me at 10.15. No we take no souls for granted. They just fit. <laughs> BFO, mother. Big facts home. Bring that weak bullshit. Shouts out, Nick, for coming out as an incel, AKA an involuntary celibate. Like, I respect him for that. Like, it's gonna be a big day tomorrow. <laughs> I change. respect the community. Like, involuntary celibate. Like, he wants to get laid, he just can't do it. Very calm, cool, and <laughs> anti sophisticated. I'm so, so, I'm so cool, right? <laughs> Like, don't lean on that thing. It just scares me. As his name. Actually, as all you people, please don't lean on that thing. Like, this hard, legit, legit. One of those broke in a room nearby here. Brandon, what was that? <laughs> so, um, decided to make a semi-large decision here, uh, not large for you guys, but large for me, as is this is my life being recorded. This will be, I think, what is this, week 67? This will be the last vlog I put out, not forever, for a few weeks, probably, maybe like a month or so. I'm taking a break from the vlogs after 65 or 66 straight weeks. I don't know the order because YouTube sometimes just deletes my videos because there's copyright in them. So the, the order gets messed up and whatever. But uh, yeah, this is going to be my last vlog for the near future. I'll be back though before the end of the summer for sure. I have a lot on my plate right now with all the projects that I'm trying to get done and everything that I'm trying to accomplish. It's really kind of been taking a toll on me, like mentally. And I'm kind of looking at, you know, where the different pieces of this, where can I sacrifice? Like where can I start working less? So that I can focus on the most important things. And this is super important to me. There's a reason I did it for 67 straight weeks. Thing is, a lot of my days are very monotonous. It's because I have so much, so much work on my plate. I've been so head down and focused on specific things. And you know, my life has been pretty fucking boring to be honest with you. So I don't feel, there's not an energy in me to share this content. Like when I first started the vlogs, I was so, it was like super exciting. It was mad fun for me to kind of film and show you what's going on and like see things from my perspective and see things from my world. And this is how I share my personality. Uh, but as of late, it's starting to kind of become more of a job, I guess I could, I should say. And I think anytime you start looking at hobbies or passions and they just start to take a burden on you, right? They seem more like a job than they actually are enjoyable, that's when you're getting burnt out. And that's why I'm not stopping forever. I just feel like I'm very burnt out because on top of all the work I'm doing, then like Friday hits and I'm like, shit, I need to take a few hours to edit all this and upload it and make sure it gets out. Even though I felt like I barely filmed this week. And now I find myself like towards Wednesday or Thursday before the weekends, like, oh shit, I need to start filming content for my vlog. Whereas the 60, you know, 60 prior weeks to that, it was always like a lot of fun shit going on throughout my life. And I think it's more so just like what's going on in my life and me not doing a lot because I'm, I'm so head in head in the laptop and head in the notebook and stuff trying to get shit done right now because this is like my busy season it just become more of a job and a burden to me than an actual like creative outlet and an actual positive in my life i guess you could say as much as i hate to break the streak i just you know i, I feel like it's it's something that i need to do because this happened to me at the end of last fantasy football season i remember by like november december after doing videos from march all the way through april may june july august september october november 
through December. I couldn't fucking wait for the fantasy season to be done. So that's a good example because that what like obviously this is a passion of mine, fantasy football. But like when you burn yourself out and you're writing so much content per week and and video editing and filming the videos and stuff, it starts to burn you out, right? And it starts to be be more of a job. And you're like, oh, I can't stop because other people depend on me and shit. And going for that, like I know a lot of people. The audience isn't as big for my vlogs, but there are a lot of people that are passionate about them because a lot of you guys reach out to me and say stuff pertaining to these vlogs and how they help you get through things or give a positive outlook to you in life. And that doesn't mean like, guys, my fucking email still open. I'm not shutting down social media or anything. So you could always DM me and always email me like you, you know, like you've always been able to. And I'll, I'll reach back out to you, of course. The weekly vlogs are going to take a backseat to the more important work that I need to focus on that's going to push my life forward just for the next few weeks. Maybe, what is it now? It's the end of June. So maybe I'll take a break for the month of July or if I do anything fun during the month of July then I'll film it and maybe put it back up but for right now I can't I, it's hard for me to stick with the schedule of filming throughout the week editing everything on Friday because people talk about the 80 20 rule in business 20% of the things you do bring in 80% of results right so right now in this time period I know what that 20% of the stuff I need to do is and a lot of the outside noise is what's not pushing me forward. And if I can narrow down on what exactly I need to be focusing on, what exactly I need to do, then that will, you know, it's an exponential thing. So if you can do the 2080 rule for a short period of time, that would boost you as much as you focusing on 100% of the things for a long period of time, right? And I think you need to take advantage of those little instances in your life when you have that advantage. I'm just like taking a step back, looking at things realistically, and just, I don't know, just sharing how I feel because that's how I've always done these vlogs, right? So. Uh, maybe I'll put some stuff out throughout the next couple weeks just kind of checking in and showing you guys what's going on with everything But for now This will be the last piece of content that I put out on Saturdays uh, for my vlogs So I'm sorry for those of you that are disappointed But like I said the DMs are always open fellas ladies whoever it is that wants to reach out to me If you're in your fields, you could always hit me up. What else life updates before I before I log off for the week foreseeable weeks I'm going to AC for my college roommates bachelor party this weekend so that should be fun the draft day weekend i know i was talking about how it was hard to close people down i think we have about five deposits in and then i gave everyone till july 1st to get the rest of the deposits in so we look like we're going to be booked that's where i'm at in life so drop a comment down below if you have any questions before i i peace out and uh, i appreciate anyone who's watched all the vlogs up to this point guys it's been a big part of my life right this is 67 straight weeks of me doing this it's been fun it's been a good ride i just think i need like some kind of change in my life that kind of sparks new creative motivation I don't have the motivation to do it right now. And I was talking to my coach about this too. Maybe it's me moving out. Maybe it's me like, for instance, the next big major move in my life would be moving out of my, my house, right? And if I have more time to focus on things that will bring in more revenue in order to push me towards that goal, that's what I just need to do for me, right? It's best for my life. So that's kind of where my head's at. And uh, again, I appreciate anyone that's kind of stuck with me for this long. I will be back soon. The fantasy football videos will not be stopping. Those, if anything, will be increasing. And uh, maybe I'll put out some content otherwise, but until then, much love.